we must build our own destiny right here. A new France will be born, and this palace will be her mother. What palace? That one. Our father's hunting lodge. Versailles. Get back on the horse. I'll send for a snack. Couldn't eat another thing. <laughs> They just tried to kill the king. If they get to him, who's next? Actually, now there's an idea. You would have me die? You are so slow sometimes. You're slouching. It's, I need these shoes, mother. No, it's not the shoes, it's the feet inside them. And as her children, we will always know her as our home. From the farthest reaches of the earth, men will venture here simply to look upon her. And those that do, You'll never leave. We'll never forget. Fuck me. <laughs> you spent 50,000 on shoes. Well, you haven't seen the shoes. The Chevalier de Lorraine, Philippe Duc d'Orléans. You look handsome. I already told him. You did not, in fact. Forgive me, um, sir. It's no matter. I thought if I began my departure, you might sanction it. You've blessed me quite enough now. Thank you. You know, misery suits you. You wear it so very well. What do you want? Did you read the Gazette? Your husband's glorious. It is the king's glory. From what I read. Angelique, I've been meaning to return this to you. A chambermaid found it in your drawer and removed it by accident. I'll make sure she's disciplined. You seem in a very good mood. How can I not be joyful with such gifts around me? Mm. My necklace. Did you say your necklace? Yes, it is very dear to me. I thought it lost. Come now, Blueberry. The maid thought this was yours. So what was your mistress's necklace doing in your room? Which one are you? I think that might be a horse. At least that's what I've been told. <laughs> Brother. Mm -hmm. Such beauty. It was not in my room. Of course it was. I just told you. What was it doing in your room, madame? I did not take your necklace. Absolutely, I did not. Be quiet. And have a look. Woo! Are we there yet? I am bored. Decidedly so. Oh! We've no wine if that's what you're looking for. I'm looking for conversation. So beautiful. So pure. Are you in the habit of loitering around ladies' dressing rooms? Every chance I get. I live for it. A dance is a formalized conversation, my dear Sophie. Full of rules, restrictions. It was like that dress you are wearing. Hmm. Do you like it? Can't you tell? <gasps> <laughs> I brought you a gift. It's a book. I would never have guessed. Three cheers, then. Let us dance on the broken backs of your bravest men. Cease. Sorry. What was that? Oh! You mean HALT! Now there's a command. Sir, it is clear your brother is not himself. If not himself, then who is he? I am the sound of distant thunder. You ever tasted champagne before? You may be about him.
Honestly, I don't know what you see in him. Oppose you, but you are mistaken. Oh, for heaven's sake, eat something. What on earth's the matter? I am expecting a child. If the king's hair hurts, perhaps it was the wine last night. I know they say eat the fur of the beast that bit you, but who wants a mouthful of fluff for breakfast? Did I speak out of time? You wanted me in this color because it's regal. I hate it. Some people care about making an impression, darling. Clearly. <laughs> <clears throat> Two minds that think as one. Would you have me change masks? Not at all. The heart, the mother of the universe. Without its warmth and light, all life is gone. Man will cease to exist. One could almost believe he was talking about you. You must bow to me. On my father's life? Your father's dead. My mother then. Forget it. I cannot help my tongue. Please. It runs in the family, my dear. Christ have mercy! I will say this for my brother. He has great taste. Get out! Get out, I will tell the king! Tell him what? My dear heart. I am his brother. I will always be his brother. You are merely passing through. So if I were you, I'd enjoy it while you can. Because it feels warm when the sun shines. But believe me, as soon as he's done with you, all the lights will go out.